Laugh if you will, you just be happy as that fucking hair with me now. At the age of six, my grandmother, a cruel Sicilian witch with long white hair, which smelled like camphor, died in bed while sleeping next to me. For years afterwards, I was chased through the fruit cellar by the evil apparition of a heinous cackle. My mother was surrounded by death, too. She had 11 brothers and sisters, only three of which lived to see adulthood. Pneumonia, tuberculosis, cancer, diabetes, stroke, a sick brood indeed. I spent my formative years in a town where future hillside strangler, Kenneth Bianchi, conducted his first experiments in lust killing. Month after month, when I was 11 years old, the lurid details of his latest victim, always a pre-adolescent girl my age, would be slayed across the evening news, a front page of the daily paper grid marking the map of bodies. I was absolutely convinced. 